it's Emily from Template Monster. In this video, we will talk about HTML templates installation, text editing, changing slider images, removing sections or blocks from the page, fav icon editing, and changing copyright. So, let's start! First of all, we need to open the template files on the computer and find the business sim folder then go to the website and find build folder. Then pack the content of this folder into a zip archive and upload it to our hosting. Click extract to unpack the files and then enter the name of your site in the browser and see your installation. So, how to edit the text? We need to use special tools to edit the text and make any changes in the code. Sublime Text 3 and Notepad++ are the most common code editors for this purpose. I'm gonna change this section and using search bar I'll find it and let's change it to the sample text. Save our change and then upload it to the hosting. I'll write it and reload. As you can see, changes applied. What about change slider image? To change the image in the slider, open the page where the slider is located and find the section in the code. It will contain a line with the image root. Let's find the image root. It's into image one. Use the search bar. We found it. And now uh, we should upload to the assets mg folder the image we would like to change its new image and change the name in the code editor save our file and again upload it to the hosting Let's close it and reload the page. As we can see, change applied. So what about remove sections or blocks from the page? First, select what exactly you want to delete from the site page and find the code of this section using inspector. For example, we will uh, just delete this section. Again, using this to inspect its begin services section. And now you can just comment it if you would like to use it in future, or you can just remove all the code. How to comment it? It's really simple. And now you should save it and 
again upload our updated file all right and close this and reload the page that's all for changing five icon uh, you should go the same way as you change the regular image but it's better to use the common name like we go to the assets mg and fav icon folder then upload our fav icon overwrite it and when we reload the page we can check the changes the last thing i'm gonna talk is how to change the copyright uh, to change the copyright open the web page in the code editor and in the search bar we're gonna find copyright yes and then i'm gonna change it to 2020 family and save then again we will upload the updated file to the hosting reload the page and check changes that already applied so okay guys that's it for today and if you're looking for high quality HTML templates to enhance your productivity and workflow, consider going to Template Monster Digital Marketplace. Thanks for watching!